people are oppressing you. Isaiah 14, real quick. Isaiah 14, real quick. What people are oppressing you? I don't know what that sister's nationality is. So I'm not going to call her white or whatever. What right? Again, the spirit bears witness. So I'm not going to point to her and say what she is. Okay. I'm going to tell you what you are, though. Well, and you, you're talking about we're oppressed now, but you're talking about. In the Bible, we're lifted up. Oh, and how do you dare not get lifted up in the Bible as well? Because the Bible is your history book, brother. Hey, sis, now, sis, I don't think the sis understands that we we had our we had our dealings before, right? She was in the same the same shoes as you. I, I pray that you keep coming. And you need to get a fly because the sis had a great question though. You said you, you're trying to the sis the sis said that she was programmed, and our sisters are programmed to go against the black man. We're your brothers. Right. We are your brothers. Yes. Sis. But now I want to show the sister how she gets. No, you haven't been, okay, but, you're, you. but you're going uh, against the you. world. I just, I just against want, Timothy make, 2, verse 9. We're going to show sure. you how to deal with the black now, man and how you're going to get salvation. You want to get salvation. No, we're not going to deal with being quiet. Yeah, Read. This is the book of 1 Timothy. Hold on now. The Bible says that for women, though. Sis, get that Corinthians 14. Get Corinthians 14. Yes, watch. It says for women. To keep silence in the churches. Read. But you're... But you're not understanding the context. First Corinthians 14. You're not understanding the context of it. It's the book of First Corinthians. You're not understanding the context of it. It, it's the first book, of, book of First Corinthians, who, who chapter first fourteen, three, who is he verse thirty-four. Three, Watch this here. Let your women keep silence in the church. It says, "Let your women do what? Keep silence in the church." Read. For it is not permitted unto them to speak. Now let's get the context. Read the verse up. Read the verse up. Read. Verse, verse thirty-three. And now it said, "Let the women keep silent in your church. It's not permitted for the women to speak." Why? Read. For God is not. The author of confusion. Because women bring confusion. No disrespect. But it says God is not the author of confusion. Read. But up. of peace. But of peace. Now read on. What is the Bible saying? As in all life. churches of the saints. As in all churches. Because when women what come, does, this right what, here. What does, when black what men come up and try to teach their people, our main adversary is our husband, sisters, husband, unfortunately. Right. Husband, right. Husband, unfortunately, it's our sisters. Now, get Timothy word. chapter 2. Husband. Matter of fact, get Corinthians 11. What does and the Bible say about God is not created for a woman. I mean, man is not created for a woman. What does the Bible say how you're supposed to treat your wife? It's going to tell you how. We get a Ephesians no, no. 5 in a second, but say? we're going to deal with the sister because you want Ephesians. salvation. I know you do. I can see it in your spirit. And part of your salvation is actually humbling down and act supporting the black men as we That's resurrect, as we bring ourselves together. It That's is not what it says. It says. It does not say Timothy support the black man. Oh, yeah. It does not say Get that. that. Timothy 2. Go to Timothy what 2. What are you talking about? Read verse 9 and you're going to read all the way down. Read. This is the book of 1 Timothy, chapter 2 and verse 9. Verse 9. And like men also, that women adorn themselves in modest apparel. I'm calling you to gather them. Come on. To adorn themselves in modest apparel, right? Not showing your body off, right? It's supposed to be modest apparel. So yeah. our women are not supposed to walk around in skin tight pants, right. walking around showing their skin, showing their flesh to right. attract sexual attention from right. men. Yeah, no. But that's pushed by our society though. But we have a savior. Right, but read on. With shame faces. With shame faces. Now our Holy women, the laws for women is to be shame faced. Now I'm gonna ask you a question. Is she being shame faced right now? Transform us. Is she being shame faced right now? I'm not disrespecting her. It says with same faces, read. And so bright. With a clear and level head, read. Oh. And not with broided hair. Not about your hair, go ahead. Or gold or pearls or costly array. Read on. But 
which becometh women professing about? godliness. The women professing godliness what read with good works. About? With good works. The good works are the keeping of the most high's commandments. Read on. Let the woman learn in silence. Let the women do what? Learn in silence. So when the Bible's coming out, our women are actually supposed to be oh silent. Gosh. And just learning. We're not yes, teaching our, men, our women to do anything but love doing? themselves and what love their Jesus people, love their doing? men. That's all we're teaching. Doing? Read. With what all subject. With all when you're subject unto someone, when a woman is what learning in silence and in subjection, doing? what is she doing? If your child is in subjection, doing? we saw your son before, right? Yes. Is your son in subjection to you? Yes. So when you say, son, go go do this for me, what does he do? Yes, mom, I'm gonna do that, right? Well, now read that verse again. With all Jacqueline? subjection. So said, let the women learn in silence with all subjection read. Who is Mary but Jacqueline? I suffer not a woman to teach. He did what? I suffer Who not a Jacqueline? woman to teach. Because I suffer what not is, a woman to teach, Jesus's nor to usurp authority. Now, okay, that's I'll, being I'll done now. You. Authority I'll is being usurped over you what? Over no the man. Over the man. You that's clear no as day. She's speaking over us. And we're no bringing out authority. the word of God. Read. But to be God. in silence. But to be what? In silence. Read. For Adam was first born. Because Adam was first born. Now this is getting to your point now. Because our women need to learn how to humble down unto men. That's the, the only way the you're prophet? going to get what salvation, the sis. The, the only way our sisters what are going to get salvation is if they humble down to a man. What it says, the Adam was first formed. Read. Then Eve. Then Eve was formed. Read. And Adam was not you're deceived. Not and Adam was not, not deceived, so read. But the woman being deceived was in the transgression. It says, but the woman being deceived was in the transgression. That's why we read in Corinthians. God's not the author of confusion. So what right? That's Adam why it says, I suffer not a woman to speak why or to did, teach the men in the Bible because Adam followed his wife. Than read. Eve did. Notwithstanding, she shall I'm be I'm going to show you that in a second. Read. Notwithstanding, oh, she shall be saved in childbearing. She shall be what? Saved. In childbearing. It says she shall be saved in childbearing, read, if they continue in faith. If you continue in the faith. What is the faith though? Read. And in charity and holiness with sobriety. In holiness and sobriety. Now, what does that saved in childbearing really mean? And we're going to deal with what the sister said. Adam was, Adam was punished worse than Eve, right? Go to Genesis chapter 3. Let's deal with that. She shall be saved in childbearing. Right? That means bringing forth righteous children. Who is Mary? Read that. It's the book read of Genesis. Genesis the chapter 3 and verse 16. Read verse 16. Read. read. Unto the woman. He says, unto the woman, what's going to happen? Pay attention. Hey, sis. Sis, pay attention, sis. Pay attention, sis. Now you see that's of the devil. But don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And will be in with us forever. Paid, and that's what happened to Adam right there. Right. That doctrine right there is what happened to Adam, and that's why we all died today. Right. Because of that type of doctrine. Read on. Genesis chapter 3, verse 16. Sis, you want to be saved, right? Sis, pay attention, sis. Read. Unto the woman, uh -huh. he said, I will greatly multiply thy sorrow. He said, I'll greatly multiply thy sorrow. Read. And thy conception. And thy conception. She shall be saved through childbearing. Read. In sorrow, it says, in sorrow, thou shalt bring to bring forth children. So part of the woman's punishment was every month you're going to have a remembrance of the, the sin of your foremother Eve. Every month you feel that pain. Every month you go through that cycle. Why? And when you're having children, is that a when you're giving birth? Is that a great? Is that a fun thing? The or is it painful? It's painful, right? The Most High God said he, that's that's the woman's punishment. For going against Adam and, and teaching that type of doctrine the right there. Read. Right. And thy Christ desire, the and thy desire shall be that what? Shall be to thy husband. That's what our women have to get back to. Right. Their desire has to get back to their husband. Right. Their black husband. Right. The so called black no Hispanics and Native Americans. We have wrong, but we have received and it he wrong. shall rule over thee. And that man is going to rule over you, not in wickedness, though. You're not going to be a, a damn a slave where he carries around the shackles and chains. He's going to love you. He's going to provide for you. Right. He's going to guide you. Right. He's going to protect you. He's right. going to rule over you. That's why he says, and she shall be saved through childbearing, meaning the willingness to bring forth more righteous Israelite children in subjection under a black man. Right. Now, right. Like mentioned, Adam was, Adam was hit worse. Read on. Let's deal with Adam, though. Because he said Adam was punished worse. Read. Verse 17. Go ahead. And unto Adam. He, he said, said, unto Adam. Now, what was Adam's problem? We got all Israelite men up here now. 
Watch what Adam did. Let me show you what the Most High God, why Adam, why the Most High dealt with Adam Reed. Adam. Unto Adam, what did what the Most High God say to Adam Reed? Because thou has hearkened unto the voice of thy wife. Because you did what? Hearken unto the voice color. of thy wife. He said, Adam, because you have hearkened, you have listened to the voice of your wife. Right. Read it again from the top. And unto Adam, he said, because thou has hearkened unto the voice of thy wife. Because you listened to that feminist nonsense. Marriage is 50-50. Right. Um, a woman has just as much voice as a man. Oh, a no. woman doesn't have to be subject unto a man. That's a true. woman doesn't have to humble woman himself. He listened to husband. that. Read. Well, and has eaten of the tree of which I commanded thee, you are not saying, my Go ahead. thou shalt not, not eat of it. Don't gain the wisdom and knowledge of all that. I'm going to show you something in a second. Just read. Cursed is the ground for thy sake. Now, now things wasn't plentiful for Adam anymore. He had to work for every single thing that he got. Now read. And sorrow Thou eat of it wife, all the I days thought. of thy life. Because he had to labor. Now, she said that she's you not our, uh, we're not her husband, right? You're Get not, Corinthians you're not, 11. You're not, you're not 1 Corinthians I understand. 11. And but but you love read. Your wife, that's Be ye church. followers of me, even you as I also am So the most high God Christ is giving the divine church. order now. Because the sister said we are not her husband. Read. Verse 3. But I will have you know that the head of every man is Christ. So every man is do head is Christ, read. And the head of the Christ woman is the man. No, the head of the church. woman is her husband. The head the, of the woman is the man. The head of the woman is her husband. The head of the woman is the man. The head of the woman is the man, read. And the head of Christ is God. The head of Christ is God. Now, of course, if she's married, church. then her head is her husband. Do if she's not married, her head Christ. is her father. If her father's not there and if her husband's not there, like many of our sisters in the body, her head is the elders. Give me that and treat the elders as fathers. Elders. First, 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 first Timothy five. First Timothy elders. five. Read that. You're not the elders. Read that. First Timothy chapter five the gospel with and no verse power. one. Bring it on. Rebuke not an elder. It says rebuke a, not an elder. We're person. being rebuked right now. You're and honestly, we are. are the elders. You are the elders. Rebuke not an elder. So it says You're rebuke not an elder. elder. Read. But entreat him. As a you're father, and treat an him elder. as a father, and treat him not, as a head. So if you're not married, elder. and if your father's not in this truth, you're not an that is what elder. it is. Let me show you what an elder is. Give me that in um, is you, Wisdom of Solomon, you Wisdom, Wisdom of Solomon, chapter four. Let me show you what the, the elder is. Read. You're it's the book of Wisdom of Solomon, chapter no four, power. verse nine. Read But wisdom is the gray hair unto men. So it says, wisdom is the gray hair of the men. Read. But you're and not an preaching the gospel. Life. An unspotted you're life. An unspotted life means a life that you're living in repentance now. Right. That us, these men up here, what? we all have turned into an unspotted life, meaning what? we acknowledge our sins and we turn, we repent right. daily. Sis, that's okay, our exactly. job. Right. Read. But you believe in and the an law. unspotted life. An unspotted life. Law. Read. It's old age. It's old age. So yes, we are the elders for you our sisters not. that need guidance. You right. Not. Our sisters You're not need my guidance. Elder. Sis. You're not my Listen. elder. You're not An my elder. Unspotted life is old age, an You're honorable age, right? right. So even though you may be older than us, we're walking in the faith of Christ, governing, we're governed by the most high God to teach this Bible. Guess what? We are your elders you're, and we are your heads to guide and protect elder. you. Show you how you get salvation. You right. human beings see how we read the laws law. about women being in you're subjection and women keeping silent? It says if you repent law. off that spirit, now, if you the most high God will deal with you, sis. Most high, give me um, give you me um, the law and you three. say that you Please. love your wife as Christ and love the church. Now repent. Get now three. repent. Uh, this is the now book repent. To the repent. Three. And verse 19. For the kingdom of repent. heaven is upon you. Repent. Read. Go ahead. Repent. And be converted. Repent. And be converted. Before what the day of reckoning comes upon you. It says repent and be converted, right? What converted? Repent. Read that. Repent. So, to the you do not love your wife seven. as Christ. Bring it out. The church. law of the you do Lord not love is perfect. Your wife as it says the law you of the Lord is perfect. You do not wash your wife converting in the word. The you do not it cleanse her. It says converting you the soul. Read. You control. The testimony you of the control. Lord is sure. Is it says the testimony She's of the Lord is sure. Read. Making wise the simple. Making wise the simple. Right. Not to you. So we have to understand that. And you know, sis, you'll be all right. Just keep coming. The Most High is going to deal with you. Let me show you how the Most High deals the with people, though. Give me that Hosea and 5 and 15. The day of you don't want the Most High to deal with you. And give me that in Job, where it says he opens their ears through oppression. Yes. Let me show you how the Those Most High deals. Those who have ears, let them hear. Those Read. who this have eyes, This is the book of Hosea, 
to the fun in verse 15. Listen, you don't hear. take heed to the word of God you that the men are no preaching. Watch how the Most High deals the with his people. Is over you. I will go and return to my place. Most High God said, I'm going to go and return to my place, read. Till they acknowledge their own fix. Just right here. You have this no is power. God going and returning to his place. No power. Only you God can no allow power. a nation of people to take another people nation of people and, and oppress them the way we are being oppressed. How many people have you Only to God fight. can allow that. Read. But you keep them out. I will go and return to my out. place. Go ahead. So they acknowledge their own faith. Go ahead. And seek you. my face. And you, you got to start seeking God's face. The truth out. of this Bible here. You keep people Read. out. In their affliction. In their what? In their affliction. It says in their affliction. Read. They will seek me earth. So guess what? You're not if it's ordained for the sis right here to come back Jesus and to do what God Jesus tells him to do, what's he going to do? In their affliction, what's he going to do? They will seek me earth. It says in their affliction. God forbid, sis, that, that God has to no deal power. with you, sis. That's why no one is we don't turning. want God you to deal no with you, oh, sis. You, have you know no how many power. people are turning you now? No One power. of our brothers got shot last week you doing a fly no mission power. in St. Louis. You have right. no Guess power. what? Guess how many people are turning you now to St. Louis? No we got thousands of brothers right now in St. Louis now to support our brother that got shot serving God. Right. No so power. what do you mean? Look at our congregation. Who's Preaching the gospel is the power of where, God. Where, Sis, where, read that in Job. Job chapter 36 and verse 15. Bring it on. He delivered the poor. In his affliction, he delivered the poor in his affliction, body. read, and you opened it their ears. The most high God opens your what ears you through what? For? In oppression. In oppression. So guess what's going to have to happen to sis if she doesn't want to no, no. listen right now? Watch who you put your mouth on. What's going to happen? Read, read again. He delivered the poor in his affliction. I'm not going to say nothing. Let the Bible talk. I'll let the Bible speak. Go ahead. And open it their ears. He opened whose ears? Their ears. He opened my ears. In oppression. He opened that brother's ears. In oppression. He opened that brother's is in oppression. He opens that brother's the ears in oppression. Sis, he opens the your ears in what? In oppression. That's how the most high God deals the with his people. Because right. right. he knows we're stiff neck and rebellious no. people. So he we you must be oppressed in you. order to wake you up. See. You understand? You can't see. Let's hear her out for a second. No, brother, we know this sister already. Why you want to hear her out? Get that in Genesis chapter 3, verse 17. Again. Bring it on! Get that in Genesis chapter 3, verse 17 again. Read. Genesis chapter 3 and verse 17. Oh and unto Adam, he said, said, unto Adam, he said what? Because thou hast hearkened unto the voice of thy wife. He said, because God has listened to the voice, because Adam has listened to the voice of his wife. Read. And has eaten of the tree of which I commanded thee. And have eaten of the tree. That philosophy right there. God right. loves everybody. Right. And the man is not over the woman. Gee. And all that nonsense. Brother, you are a black man. Right. You're an Israelite according to the Bible. You're That's ordained right. to be a ruler on this earth here. Right. The reason why we wait, fell wait, 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 is because wait, 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 wait. of... So I got a question. What, what you got? Are we both good? Are what does it mean? Good? What is good, brother? Are we, are we both good in the eyes of the Lord the same way? First of all, we not Christians. I'm we don't deal with Christianity. Christian Brother, you're an Israelite according to the Bible. That's right. You're right. not a Christian. The Most High did not give us Christianity. Give me that in Psalm 78. Bring it out. Establish a law. Psalm 78 and 5. Let me show you what the Most High God did. Religion is created like to confuse us. Be, right? right. That's why. How many denominations of Christianity is it, Brother? Bring it out. Yeah, a lot. Right? Why? Does that not breed confusion? Jeez. You say you're a Christian. You're Baptist, Pentecostal, Methodist, all those different things. Catholic. Right. That's confusion. Right. So all of that is nonsense. Read that. Psalms. Here's what God established for you, brother. Read. Psalm 1078, verse 5. Read it For he established a testimony in Jacob. He established a testimony in Jacob. He established, you are the sons of Jacob, the right. sons of Israel. Right. The so-called black, Hispanic, and Native Americans. Read. Right. And appointed a law. He appointed a law. Read. In Israel. In Israel. That's how, that's what we follow. So, so I, I agree that, you know, the, the Israelites were originally black. I agree with you on that. We're like, originally black. They, they are always been black, right? Okay. So what is the difference between the way you worship and the way that someone who is white would worship? Is there a difference in our prayers in, in your word? Is there a difference in the way the Lord to. views us? Does the Lord take favor of one or the other? That's what I want to ah, know. That's a great question. Does the Lord take favor yeah, of one or the worship? other? It says in and our how you worship. That we believe, right? The true worshipers worship in spirit and truth. But let's you get know, that. You no, let's get that. Let's yeah. get that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Spirit, spirit and truth. truth. Yeah. Your spirit and truth. Yeah. It's a woman, but spirit and truth. Not let's deal with the Bible. We're going to quote the scripture that she said, right? Bring it up. We can teach you. Read that. Matthew, what is it? 
They that worship me, worship me in spirit and in truth. It's John chapter 4. Spirit and in truth. Read that. It's the book of John. I'm not going to be twisted. Read. It's the book of John chapter 4 and verse 24. Read out. God is a spirit. It says God is a spirit. Read. And they that worship him. It says they that worship God. Read. Must worship him in spirit. Must worship him in spirit and in what else? And in truth. And in truth. So now your question should be, what does that mean? What does it mean to worship him in spirit? What is the spirit? It's not flesh. Get John it's chapter 6. Bring, Bring it out. out. Bring it out. No, we don't deal with color. We just told the sister a couple minutes ago, there's no such thing as mixed. Our people come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. You understand that? We're not just going to the black man because you're brown skin. We got Israelites that look just like that sister back there. We deal with the, no, the sister that you with. It's Israelites that could be her. It's based on the bloodline of your father. It's not about color. Read that. John chapter 6 and verse 63. Read. It is the spirit. That quick it said it's the spirit that quick and it read the flesh pro profit if nothing our flesh doesn't profit nothing right. the spirit is what changes and what changes you read the words that i speak unto you it says the words that jesus christ speak the words in this bible is what you i says no hey keep coming back sis read they are spirit it says the words are what they are spirit it says the words are spirit read and they are life and they are life Brother, we're reading out the Bible. Yeah, I got you. It says, read it again. 6 verse 63. How y'all doing? It is the we're going over what the spirit is. It says you should worship God in spirit and in truth. Read. It is the spirit that quickened it. Go ahead. The so, flesh no. profit nothing. Go ahead. So, the so, words so, that I speak so, unto you, so, they so, are spirit. It says the words of the Bible are spirit. Read. And they are life. And the words of the Bible is life. So it says what the spirit is. Now it says spirit and truth. What is the truth? Because the sister want to bring up that you have shorts on, so you're well, going to be condemned, right? I'm just saying what you said. Sis, I'm, I'm that's part of repentance, though, what? sis. But you can't call me Read. to repent. Read. Psalm chapter 119, verse 142. Here's the truth. Thy, but, but why should she repent? Here's the truth. The Listen, here's the truth. So thy read. righteousness oh. is an everlasting righteousness. It says thy righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. And what's the truth? Read. And thy law. And the laws of God is what? Is the truth. Is the truth. So when you worship Christ, now go back to um John 4 okay, and read that. Hold on, let's get the understanding, then we go to the next one. Read. John chapter 4, verse 24. Go ahead. God is a spirit. Go ahead. And they that worship him must worship him in spirit. You worship him in spirit, meaning according to the words of this Bible, read. And in truth. And in truth, according to God's laws. Right. So you got to be willing to keep his laws and worship him according to the words written in this what Bible is, here. Now, you mentioned the there's not, says nothing about your clothes, what right? This, what? Get that in Deuteronomy 22, and That's then we got to wrap up. Deuteronomy 22. Said. That's not what he said. Let me show you what the law says. That's not what he said. The original question I was getting at. What? Is, I'm personally a Christian. I like to explore other beliefs to see if my, if my belief is a true belief. You know, I, I do that. I like to explore the beliefs. So I know that you are the black. You're, you're black. You're Israelites. You I know an that. Israelite. That's a nationality. It's not a religion, bro. Yeah. You come right. from the bloodline. This is your forefather. Right. Mm -hmm. This is the but lost saying, information that we want to have. I'm right. saying that. We don't know who our forefathers are. That's not. Are. It should be your priority. Read. That's the problem I'm saying what? to you. It's Get not your, your priority. Get your priority. That's not our priority. Read that. There are Israelites that are. Read that. Jesus should be your priority. Read. There are Israelites. It's the book of Job, chapter eight and verse eight. Read it. It's not your priority to know your forefathers. That's what she said, right? Let the Bible speak. For inquire, I pray thee, of the former age, Read. and prepare thyself. It says prepare yourself. Prepare your... Notice when the scripture comes out, she interrupts it so you don't get the understanding. Now, she mentioned that the, the your priority should not be your forefathers, right? Read that from the top again. Pay attention. For inquire, I pray thee, of the former your age. Your should be of the former age. Who were the slaves before slavery? Who am I? Why does Black History Month start with Martin Luther King and the slave trade and not beyond that? Right. It says inquire of the former age. Read. And prepare thyself. It says prepare yourself now. For the what? To the search of their father. To the search of your forefathers. Your forefathers, Abraham, right. Isaac, right. Jacob, right. Isaiah, right. Jeremiah, right. John the Baptist, Paul, all of these right. men, Paul, Peter, right. those are your forefathers. That's, That's right. your history. You are the Israelites according to the Bible, brother. That's right. Go ahead. There, there are people who are Last Israelites, question. and they worship, they worship Allah. Uh -huh. There are people who are Israelites who are atheists. What right. is the difference between? Are those people still welcome? 
is someone who has no blood relation to these prophets still welcome? Is a white person who has no blood relation from um, Norway still welcome to come worship the Lord? And Let me show you Lord? something. Give Romans 8 verse 16. Bring it up. We're stuck on color for, for some reason, right? That's what you preach. You got No, we <laughs> preach neck. I never mentioned color at all. As a matter of fact, I said that sister right there. Could we got Israelites that look just like her. Let's Get right. Romans 8 verse 16. This Bring is how we worship. Back. Read. Romans chapter 8 back. verse 16. Bring Bring out. The spirit itself beareth witness with our spirit. We already read what the spirit was, which is the words of God. Right. And that's going to bear witness with our spirit. Right. Read. Right. Read. That we, that are, the, we are the what? Are the children of God. If you can identify with the word, because the sister said we can't trace our bloodline back. No, we can't. None of us can. Right. But if you can identify with your people have went through these things. Right. If you can accept and identify the truth of the Bible that Jesus Christ was a so-called black man with out. hair of wool, right. Right. you have to understand that that means that you are what, Reed? But we're agreeing Reed. on everything. We, that of. we are the children of God. That we are the children of God. Now get Hosea, Ephraim is a cake not turning, yeah. then we're gonna wrap it up. Let me show you, this is not about color, yo. This is not about color at all. We never mentioned color, Reed. Hosea 8. Oh, uh, sis, you, you, if you come to the school and see how we worship, you'll see all different uh, colors. Uh, uh, it's the book of Hosea, chapter 7, and verse 8. Read out. Ephraim had mixed himself among the people. Ephraim has mixed himself amongst the people. Read. Ephraim is a cake not turned. It says Ephraim is a cake not turned. Ephraim is one of the tribes of Israel. Right. He's part of the northern kingdom. Right. When you have a pancake and you put it in the pan, Bring it up. when you don't turn it and you pick it up, what side? What color is one side? Yeah, it's cooked. It's brown, yeah. right? Right. And what color is the top part that you did not turn? Bring it up. It's white. It's another. It's, a, it's the same color as the batter. Right. So it says Ephraim is a what? Ephraim. It have mixed himself among the people. Because of all the different captivities and the lust of our flesh, we've mixed ourselves with all the other people, Read, Right. Ephraim is a cake not turned. So we come in all different colors, brother. It's yes. about your spirit. And if you can bear, if your forefathers went through this, Teach. if you can accept that you must keep God's laws, statutes, and commandments, right. and then you can accept the truth of this Bible, right. we are not to question you. That's why Christ said, let them grow together, the wheat and the tares, and then up. the angels will come, the reapers will come, and we that out at the end of the day. We right. don't turn nobody yeah. back based off their color. Matthew 26. What you got? You have no power. The, the, my main question was, I do, agree. No I do agree that black history has been erased throughout time. They're trying to erase it till this day. Um, I agree that it's Israelite important. history. Israelite, Israelite black history. Black history has been given to you. Black history right. was created here in America to teach you right. that Christopher Columbus discovered America. Teach. He brought you over here as six, as slaves. Now they change it around. They Teach. say we were servants or something. Let's, let's say people, let's say we let's willingly people came people. over here and now we're actually citizens now. Right. That's black history. Civil and then we had the civil rights movement and now we all so should live in Arab. peace. Read. So, so but no, I'm not done. I'm not done because I'm agreeing with Last you question. on these. Right, what you got? I'm agreeing with you on the fact that black his like Israelite history, let's say Israelite Hebrew, history, history, Hebrew, whatever you want to call it. I, I agree that they're they're erasing whatever the fact that the, 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 whatever you want to call it. Keep coming. Listen, okay, oh, hold on. Let me get no, no, no. get another no, no. Can, no, no. Can, can I Let me go ahead, bro. You're you're good. You're good. I'm I'm listening to you. Don't worry. I'm listening to you. Most of the time I'm dealing with you. But the thing I'm saying is that I told you to keep your name, keep my mouth up. Don't do that. No, no, no. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. So I, I agree with you that hey, this, this is our history. This is history that is important. This is history that we need to teach to empower our people, right? Exactly. Um, I, and I think that this history could empower not just people with our skin tone, but people with different skin tones, right? Let me ask right? you a question. Now and you said that. Let I me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Are the people with different skin tones already in power? Bring it out. Bring it out. In the society, but in the world Stop. of God. In this society, in the are they? Hold on. Oh. That's what wow. That's what Hold, on Hold, on Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on a second now. Not the tail. Ain't that something? That's you get Matthew said. 26. But I, I mean, he said, because in this society, the they're empowered, right? So. But not in the word of God. Bring it out. And he why said, do you care about that? See? Because what? I want everyone. Hold on. Now you're oppressed now. Our people are oppressed. Our people are suffering under the foot of these same people. What are you talking about? What manifest people? destiny, right? What people? What does that mean? But she hasn't done What is manifest destiny? She people? hasn't done anything to me. So should what I know? people? Isaiah 14, Isaiah 14 real quick. What people? Isaiah 14 real quick. What people are oppressing you? I don't know what that sister's nationality is. So I'm not going to call her white or whatever. What people? Right? Again, the spirit bears witness. 
Okay. So I'm not going to point to her and say what she is. Okay. I'm going to tell you what you are, though. Well, let, let, and you, you're talking about we're oppressed now, but you're talking about in the Bible we're lifted up. Who are and how come they're not in, lifted up in the Bible as well? Because the Bible is your history book, brother. Right. 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 The Bible is your book. The Bible was written by your forefathers right. to you so that you can come up out of this. Read. Isaiah. Here's how God's going to deal with the, 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 four, the, the descendants of these people here. Yeah. Isaiah. Because, because, again, that's her. Who, Chapter oh, 14 and verse 21. Prepare slaughter. It says, does what? Prepare slaughter. The Bible says, prepare slaughter. Read. For his children. For his children. Read. For the iniquity the of their fathers. They got to pay for the iniquity of their fathers just like we're paying for the iniquity of our forefathers today. So the same way, read. That they do not rise. That they do not rise back because they're already on top. What the hell are you going to put who? them on? Who? Who are you the other about? nations, our oppressors. What are, what other read. Nations? Nor possess the land. What Nor possess nations? the land. They will not have inheritance in the kingdom of heaven that's going to be on this what earth here with us. So read. Nations? Nor Fill what the face the of the nations? earth with cities. They're not going to fill the face of the earth with cities. Read. Right. For I will rise up against them. The Most High God, we can try to stop it if we want. Right. The Most High God said he's going to rise up against the people that did this to your people. Right. And you want them to get salvation. Right. Right. Are you kidding me? The read. Oppressors. Saith the Lord of hosts. Saith the Most High God. Read. We can't change that. Read. And cut off from Babylon the name. Cut and, off the name and what else? And the remnant. And the remnant of what? And son and the son and nephew and nephew all their siblings and all their children are going to be put to death free says the lord that's just what it is brother you but, the kingdom of heaven is for you matthew 26 we got to go you know? matthew chapter 26 and verse 6 now when jesus was in bethany they'll the be in the kingdom of heaven with us let me ask you a question let me ask you a question like you said, they have dominion over us any today, right? Well, I'm saying, actually, no, for real. Who has dominion over God. this country? Who runs any this country? Bring it out. All right, stop. All right, stop. So what are we to them? As a nation of people, what are we to the white people? Not all white people. Uh, but, I mean, hey, but, <laughs> what are we to the white people? <laughs> to the people that Thank run this country. But they're so what are we? We are nothing but white people. You know, We're servants, laborers. Right. Another word for laborers is what? Slaves. Slaves. Okay, look. So guess what's going to happen? When we have dominion on the earth, not what's going to happen? Get, get Isaiah 14. We want to finish yeah. this up. Let's not say they're not going to make it. We wrestle not. The same the way you're right here right now, right. you're a descendant of this, and they have dominion over us, right? right. And But we're in their kingdom. We serve. You said we're laborers to them, right? But, but in now my, watch what's going to happen, Bible. brother. This one you should want. Read Isaiah chapter 14 and verse 1. Read out. For the Lord. We'll have mercy on Jacob. Brother, the Lord is going to have mercy on you. Read. So I know my blood. And will right? yet choose was, Israel. And will yet choose Israel. Read. And set them in their own land. You're going to set the so-called black, Hispanics, and Native Americans in their own land. Read. And the strangers. And the strangers, the other nations. Read. Shall be joined with them. They're going to be joined with us. Right. The other nations are going to be joined with us in the kingdom of heaven. In oh, our rulership. Right. Wait, listen, they're ruling now. And we're joined with them. So, God, no, so no, I'm listen. Just, They're going to be joined with us. So we're not saying I'm, she can't make it. Read. And they shall cleave to the house of Jacob. They're going to cleave to the house of Jacob. They're going to cleave to you, black man, who is a God ordained on this earth. Read. Right. And the people shall take them. And we're going to take them and do what? And bring them to their place. That's how, in our rulership, we're going to bring the other nations to our place. How you doing today, sis? Hey, grab a flyer for the sis. Y'all brothers can have so, a flyer. Read. So Miss Lydia, read, 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 read. And the house of Israel. And the house of Israel shall do what? Shall possess them. Shall possess them for what? In the land of the Lord for servants. For servants. Right. And handmaids. The same way we're servants and handmaids under their kingdom. When we start ruling, they will be our servants and handmaids. That's just God's will, right. brother. Read. Right. And they so shall this, take this, them captives. Read. Whose captives hey. they were. Whose captives they so. were. So, so you understand I, I that? My, my so do you understand that? I, I, yeah, so I when so when the kingdom myself, comes, brother, right? when the kingdom comes, mm -hmm. just like we are servants unto them, we're laborers unto them. Yep. When right. we rule, who is going to be our servants? Bring it out. Black man. When we rule, black man, you're going to take your own people to servants or the other nation? Teach. You're going to take your own people to be your slaves? No. 
you're going to take the other nations, right? Oh, we can just have That's no just slaves, what it bro. is. There's no such thing as slaves. Can, How can, can you have a kingdom no with no slaves? Who's going to run out? Matthew 26, man. Matthew, chapter 26, verse 6. How you going to have a kingdom with no servants? Teach. What king didn't have a servant? Right. What kingdom didn't have slaves? Teach. Get out of here, man. Read. Matthew, chapter 26, and verse 6. Hey, keep looking at that flyer. Says I don't know so what your nationality I, I, I is. It says the spirit line. bears witness with the Bible. They bro, I'm gonna tell you straight my up. Listen, bro. Was not Maybe you're not a Hebrew. Bro, if you don't, if you don't receive this word, guess what? Then it's not you. Okay, that's so the bottom that's line. We used to scream black power while Haram was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. I, you, I, see, we deliver the truth.